creative boot camp, might I say. It was just a plethora of artists and, and, and producers and writers and, you know, illustrators, like people who actually do like uh, graphic art and different things. And we just wanted everything to connect, everything to kind of be cohesive as far as the, you know, the artwork, the music, the sounds, the, just even the, to the minute, you know, tedious things of it. So it's a very strenuous time and it's very picky. Like you gotta really be like over and over. You hit a record over and over with different drums and different sounds just to see how we can make this record the best record. The biggest thing that affected me was to be able to be able to explain to a producer what I would like in a track or a beat or anything like that. So that was the biggest thing for me, just being able to relay that message. A lot of times it was hard for me to kind of say, hey, I want this, I want some reverb right here, I want this to be, you know what I mean? Versus going in there and watching a producer like Kanye do it with his engineer and, and learning the lingo and knowing, you know, the effects and different things that you could put on these records. So I think that's, that's the biggest thing I learned from, just being able to create a song from scratch. One thing about good music, well, I feel like myself and, and a few artists on good music, like, we don't have the luxury to just say bullshit. We have to really give it some substance, some character, and some thought into what we're saying and what we're writing.